Hey everybody, it's Shondo, and you may have noticed I'm not on the go. Like many of you, I'm working from home, but I still want to check in with my friends during the hashtag Citrix Hackathon and see how they're doing. So let's check in with Michael Shapansky of Betchley. All right, Michael, welcome. Thank you for joining me, Michael. I really appreciate it today. Last week and this week, you've been experiencing the Citrix Virtual Hackathon, hashtag Citrix Hackathon, and uh, that's really why we wanted to talk to you today. How have you been getting along in the virtual hackathon? How's your experience? Hey, you know, it's, it's really fun. You know, have something different to do uh, beside your, your, your usual work. I met a couple of, of, of new guys in Citrix um, um, and, and chatted with them about their IoT stuff and their um, T uh, ports that is uh, just added to some micro app and things like that yeah. and and that's fun so um, I try to to do similar things that I would do if I were on a on a conference where I can meet somebody in person are these the mentors that are going on with the virtual hackathon that you're talking with or just other attendees yeah. It's both. It's, it's really both. It's other uh, uh, attendees, it's the mentors, it's other people from Citrix that just send me a mail and said, hey, you're doing the IoT stuff. I'm doing that. And, uh, yeah. you know, that's that's OK. That's fun. And that's in, in our pre-show, in our uh, green room conversation before we turn the cameras on, we were talking about your, uh, the micro apps that you were creating and, and the IoT experience within that. I'm doing IoT for a couple of years now, just in addition to my uh, normal skills um, as an IT architect. Yeah. And um, the idea was here, um, using that fast approach uh, with the actions to some easy message from something and how to respond on it without opening some complex tools or whatever. And, and so that's why I decided to do some, some micro app um, IoT integration. Um, just to see um, uh, how work would be if, if I get the important information from some IoT staff where I can put in some easy action button to, to just resolve issues and then and, and, uh, without hooking on some PC or some monitoring tool or whatever. So, so using the ease of that and, and um, that was the basic idea why I decided to do some, some, some with IoT. Gotcha. Uh, now, Michael, I know that you're competitive. Uh, are you going to submit your app to, where's my thing, to the hashtag Citrix Hackathon? Are you going to submit one? Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, <laughs> so as you said, I, I, I like competition. Um, and, and so if I'm working on something for, for a week and a half or more, um, um, yes, of course, I want to try and see uh, how I can... Uh, cope with the others on, on yeah. what's coming out of my application yes and, sure. and if you submit you could win you could win a trophy now this is not the actual trophy of <laughs> wonderful course. yeah i think this is a rod from a 1931 ford but that's they don't trust me with the real trophy so we'll use that as the placeholder so yes michael is in the yeah. running for the trophy for the citrix hackathon Trophy. So I know that we've got viewers out there and they want to know more about Betchley and where they can learn more about you and the services uh, that you all offer oh, yes. there. Where would people go for that? On our website, uh, Bechtle.com. <laughs> Um, that's an e easy first shot. Yeah. Um, so we are located really all over Germany, Swiss and Austria with um, system house locations about more than 60. And, and we are doing um, shipping of stuff all over Europe. I thank you so much for doing this. I really appreciate you taking the time out. Uh, good luck in the hackathon competition. All right, everybody, Thanks. keep tuning in. Yeah. We'll have more Thanks. from the hackathon. Bye-bye. Yeah, thank you.